Welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you're new here. Today we're checking out Pexels, a place where you can find copyright free images. If you're looking for images, stock photos, videos to use on your creative projects, Pexels is a great one to do that. Here we are on the Pexels homepage. Um, if, you're in, if you're wondering what you can use them for, you can go right up to the top here and click on the license and it tells you exactly what is allowed. I'm not going to read through all of it and exactly what isn't allowed. So there you go, it tells you everything there. Um, basically you can use anything you want without attribution, but you do have to kind of modify it in some way or another, or the other options there. So we're gonna go back to the home page here. So whatever you're searching for, you can just put that in the search there. So I always just do Tiger as my default one here. And you can see there different images. So some are by different users, but notice also that some are from Pixabay, which is a website that I've previously talked about in another video, and I'll link that to you as well. Once you found an image that you like, maybe we like, um, ah, we'll just go with this one here. It'll bring it up just in this mini window here. You can add it to a collection, you can like it. If you just hit free download it, it'll go to a default resolution size, but if you want to choose your size, then just click on the little arrow, select the one that you want, and then you can download it there. If you want more info on it, then you can click on there and it'll give you more info about everything, and then it gives you similar images below. Once you've downloaded it, so I'm just going to click on download, you can see there it says say thanks, it gives you the option to donate, to then follow that. Um, photographer, follow them on Instagram or Twitter, or um, copy that so you can add that as an attribution to wherever you are, are doing that. You can create um, a free account on Pexels here. Once you have, then you can see the different options here. You, here you can also access their frequently asked questions page, the partnerships, imprint and terms, apps and plugins, image and video API. Um, but then you can also go to your collections. And so here I just have two collections. My downloads, every time you download an image, it will show up there. Or I have one collection called Reference Photos, and I just have one saved in there right now. But that's nice because anytime you download an image, maybe you'll lose it or something, then you can go back and find it there. Or if you want to just collect images virtually online instead of doing it on your desktop by downloading it all, then you can just collect them all there as well. Uh, and it gives you a little rank. I guess I don't use enough. I don't upload anything, so um, that's what my total views are, zero. Um, if you have any questions about Pexels, though, please let me know. I'll do my best to answer them. Make sure you give this video a like and subscribe so you don't miss future videos, as I will be doing more on finding copyright-free images around the internet that you can use in your creative projects. So again, thank you for watching this one. We'll see you next time on Brian Sloan Artist.